Hello, Gemini. It's Milady from Milady's Way Tarot, and I'm coming to do your weekly love reading for the week of 10:30 through 11/6/2017. The cards I am using today are Oracle of the Mermaid cards by Lucy Cavendish, and I close off with my Miss Cleo cards. I like to read those straight out the book to ensure you get your full message. I want to thank everybody for like, sharing, subscribing, and setting up personal readings with me. All right, so it seems like someone is um starting to look at themselves for a for whatever the situation is and they starting to be honest with themselves of their feelings about an old partner that they somebody is basically saying that they still in love with their partner their ex-partner maybe a child's parent okay all right, um, let's let's get this show on the road. All right, what's going on with uh, Gemini, 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 love reading. Gemini, love reading, October, October, October 30th through November 6, 2017, love reading. Love reading, love reading, love reading. Gemini, 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 what's going on? 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 All right, I close off with my Miss Cleo cards, and I like to read those straight off the book, okay? All right, so we're dealing with somebody who believes they deserve it all, okay? This could be both parties. So it seems like everybody's getting wise right now. I think every reading that I did today, this card popped out. So it's like um, people are starting to look at things for what they are, you know? And it's, it's starting to, like, make you change your life, change things that's going on. All right, so this is dealing with, um, I feel like a child's parent. A relationship, an old relationship that, um, that you used to be in, okay? Ooh. Okay, so it seems like this person may have, um, cheated on you with somebody else, but... You might still be in love with them. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Wow. Okay, so you're still in love with them and you waiting for the time that they come back. I feel like they are in and out your life. And you just wait for, basically wait for your turn. All right, but it seems like you got the wheel and you got everything you need to leave whenever you want to you just really care about this person you're not ready yet flat out it's just that's just it all right so there are secrets going on okay what are these secrets okay so i just i feel like the secret is this person got somebody else possibly even married and you're dealing with them mm. okay All right, so um, this is basically like this person just does for you. Of course, they're going to do it for you because you got kids with them. Or if you don't have kids, y'all just got some kind of different connection, some different kind of bond going on. What's going on here? All right, so um, yeah, you're starting to see things, see yourself for what's going on. You know, you... You just start looking at the big picture, you know? You're starting to look at the big picture. All right, what's under there? All right, so you found something that you was looking for. Wow. And you're seeing that this person really don't uh, want you like that. Because in reality, if they did, they wouldn't be married or with this other person, you know? But they treat you like you want to be treated. And then, I don't know. Yikes. All right, so it seems like somebody's stalking the other person. Like, don't don't leave me kind of thing. Cut it out. All right, yeah, so somebody doesn't want this situation to be over, so they're stalking. So you could be stalking or um, the married person or person in a relationship could be stalking you. Okay, what's going on with the Gemini? Gemini, Gemini, love reading. October 30th through November 6, 2017. October 30th through November 6, 2017. What's going on? What's going on? What's going on? 
Gemini, Gemini, Gemini. All right, so somebody's working real hard. It seems like somebody's working real hard to get somebody that left them. Somebody's trying to get work real hard to get somebody to come back to them. Mm. Ooh. It seems like somebody may even be spending a lot of money. That's this gift card. Somebody's working hard, spending money, just doing everything that they need to do to try to get this person back or get this person to be with them. Okay, yeah, so it's basically some choices. Ugh, that's no, no good. So some choices that need to be made, you know? Definitely some choices to be made. Like, are you going to go back? You know, is it worth all this hard work? Is it worth all this money? You know, and I feel like somebody has been receiving some negative messages in the mail. I mean, email, whatever kind of uh, media mail coming in. But I feel like you're dealing with that. And it's like, is it worth all this? That's what you like coming to realize right now. All right. So first we have the seven of swords. Seven, seven. All right, Seven of Swords. It says, um, to gain here, much work is required. And in the end, the efforts may not pay off as well as you hoped for. Do not take the easy way or trouble will follow. So it's basically like all this stuff you're doing for this person. You're realizing that it may lead up to nowhere. And you try to think, like, should I stay or should I go? Like, where should I be? This is like the Aquarius reading also. Okay, so we have the Two of Swords. So there's a lot of people making choices. It says, a choice between two things may occur. Look for people who offer friendship and mutual respect or guidance. This makes me feel like you may possibly have somebody too. Unless you're the married person and it's telling you like who you want to choose. You want to choose this person on the side that you dealt with before. Or you want to stay with your um partner but it's making me feel like that the other party isn't too um the outside party isn't too good for you okay okay so we have the two staffs two staffs two staffs all right, the two stats is reversed. It says surprise, unexpected outfit, uh, come in fearful anticipation. I don't know why pregnancy just popped in my head, but it was so many today. That's why. But this could be you hoping this person is going to come to you or you hoping that you're going to stay with your partner and you find out there's some other stuff going on because I feel like it's more people involved in this other than just... Um, the three people i feel like it's more than three people i feel like everybody got somebody that's what the feeling i'm getting here all right so we got the nine of coins nine of coins nine of coins there's reverse it says breach of contract or promise failed task bad credit and inflated bills this makes me feel like it was definitely a marriage that went wrong i think i seen that stalking card somewhere and i feel like Somebody might have caught somebody uh, cheating. Somebody caught their husband or wife cheating. And I feel like it may be getting ready to go to court. You know, somebody's trying to decide, do I want to uh, uh, get a divorce for this situation? All right. Then we got the eight of staffs. Eight, eight, eight. All right. So it's reverse. It says envy, internal struggle, and guilty conscience. Yeah. So, the sideline person is mad with the frontline person, but then they feel bad because, like, how can I be mad at you and I'm dealing with your wife or your husband? Yep, but that's all I got. Make sure to check your sun, moon, and rising signs. If you want a person to read, check in the description box below. Email me. We can set something up. Other than that, have a wonderful week.